So here y'all check this out. This is uh one well, new that I know of. It's uh the bandsaw holder from Harbor Freight, the Hercules brand. I guess they got tired of a swag making money off their saws. So we're gonna go ahead and get this opened up and try it out. It comes with a angle finder and everything it says. It says it's upside down, but you can read it. Zero, 30, 45, and 60. We're gonna get it open and try it. Hey, YouTube, check this out. Harbor Freight came out with a bandsaw attachment. Okay. Motherfucking Hercules brand right there. And you can see we got it set up right now to do a 45 cut. So it's just a barrier top saw on it. not too shabby we also purchased one of their clamps the drill press clamps and it also has two slots this one so you can get further bigger cuts you can push the material back further and then this one if you just want to make small cuts on the other material but anyways you can take this off here and you can see how it has the increments on it you got zero there zero there 30 here 45 45 and 60. And obviously they're double printed for the positioning of this. So yeah, you can pop it out and you can put it in this hole right here. But anyways, we'll go ahead and leave it on zero. Go ahead and put the, put the piece back up that we're just cutting. The clamp, slide the clamp back up. Adjust the clamp, you know, so we can get it down. So to hold on to the material. Okay, so here's the straight cut. There you go right there. And it also comes with with a bunch of different attachments because it also does different brands it does the milwaukee it does you can see in the instructions you got the hercules one you got the Bellier one you have this is this is how to set up the trigger switch on it i'll show you that in a minute it has the gay one Oh, I mean DeWalt. Um, it has Milwaukee right there. And then the Hercules and whatnot. But anyways, it's pretty slick. I have mine on, on a foot pedal. Let's see. It's better for me. I like it like that. But if you don't want it on the foot pedal, you have the on and off button right here. So see, right now it's locked on on. You don't want it on on. Just boom. See? Then I'll press the foot pedal, nothing. So if you want it on on, you just go back like that, <clears throat> lock it in. Then I'll press the foot pedal, then we have power. And it also comes with a plate, so where you can do it horizontally right here. There's your plate. Oops, it slipped on the pedal. And then the bolts in here. We'll show you a video on that as well. But, uh, yeah, I guess they got tired of swag building attachments for their tools. So they said, you know what? Hey, we're going to come out with something better. The price tag on this is $99. I don't know what the swag price is. I haven't checked lately, but I was going to purchase the swag one. I'm glad I didn't. This one's badass. It's way better. You got the attachments up here. You can move your saw back and forth. And then just hold yourself in with these two uh, tension knobs. But then you got the trigger handle right there. And then really the, the saw is not going to go nowhere because the force of the blade, I mean, the force of as you're cutting it down is going to hold it in place. So it has that. And then see this right here, you move that, the knob right here, 
I can move this. Let's see where is that? Right there. Damn it. Hold on, bear with me. There we go. So see, that'll come off. And then that's where you can put your, uh, you put your other plate on. But it does have, it would go this way. On my saw, this one goes right here like that. Boom. But we're going to go ahead and get it set up and we're going to show you guys. All right, we have it in the horizontal mode. Not too bad, let's get a piece of flat bar. So you got to trim up some flat bar. Not bad. So overall, the stand, ooh, look at it, it went off a little bit of the track. Probably got a four inch, probably curved the blade over it a little bit, that ain't no biggie. Um, the stand, I was gonna buy one from Swag, and the stand from Swag only comes with this, and I think it's like a hundred bucks or something like that. But anyway, you get this, the flat plate, you can bolt it on there, it got slots. It is universal. The instructions have them for where you can mount it with. Okay, this one is for with the Hercules. This is for the Bayer, and that's for the Milwaukee. And then for the Dewalt, which is a piece of shit. Dewalt is a piece of shit. Dewalt belongs in the dump. But anyways, my opinion. So you have all your all the hardware right here for the other brands, and uh, inside that book with the instructions are pretty good. So that's the uh, remaining bolts. Well, good mechanic don't got bolts left, right? So, anyways, ain't nothing. Uh, I like it. It's a little heavy, but hey, what do you expect? You know what I mean? It's portable. You might as well leave your bandsaw in it. There you go, y'all. Check it out. I will, I'm going to go buy me another one. I'm going to one for my truck. So, you can see it right there. Hope you guys check it out. For me, me, I recommend this to anybody who got to shop. Or even if you're just doing some small light work. Fuck, man. 
Go ahead and get this shit. You know what I mean? It's pretty cool. Harbor Freight, Hercules brand. Knocking them out, knocking them out.